Mm. God damn it. That smells good. Camo, man, it's just this is the um the Rogue the Rogue Way uh sorry I'm, I got a new cup. This is my new cup. This is just ridiculous like apparently four karat gold, I don't know, I don't care. I don't even know what that means. She's like four karat gold. I was like, okay, Bugs Bunny, like I don't know. So if someone wants to actually comment and tell me what four karat gold means, that'd be great. Um, I'm, so I'm doing a photo shoot for the website because I realize I'm, I'm, starting to, I'm starting to put tees up on the website, um, and I'm I'm looking at the page views. I'm seeing you guys are looking at them, but I realize I have no photos, and you know I don't do cheap tees. You know, I'm about to do some porn. Um, my tees are not cheap, and so obviously, who wants to buy a sixty dollar Rogue Way? when it's not even, when there's no pictures, like you don't know what you're buying. Obviously cinnamon. Like cinnamon is just without a doubt, so I'm gonna, it's called Rogue Way, which means cinnamon, um, cause it has the cinnamon flavor, and yet sometimes you don't get the cinnamon. But that always is funny to me, um, especially in the West, you know, it's, it's a perfectly, you get some, you can get some, Yenshas, and you get a rogue way, and it might have a nice roast to it. It might be floral, but it, there's just no cinnamon. It doesn't have the rogue way flavor. Like there's no difference between that and a shui xian of the same level. Like they're both roasted the same. Um, like you can't tell it. You wouldn't be able to tell it a rogue way from a shui xian when it's like that. Um, so that's my thing. It's like. If you talk to my friends who were like talking to me, who I talked to during my first tea trip and before, I was always be like, I want the Rogue Way flavor. It doesn't have that flavor. We'd be tasting teas in Shanghai. I'd be like, nope, doesn't have the flavor. This has the flavor. This it has the Rogue Way flavor. The cinnamon, the cinnamon flavor. Hey, today I have a busy day, um, and it's kind of so. Today I am putting out. Sorry, I am busy, so I have to multitask here. Um, but I wanted to make this particular vlog um, to let people know that their teas are coming. Their teas, I fell crazy behind on um, on some orders. Um, I just got, you know, it's just I just honestly I just messed up. Like I just I got disorganized um, and. You know, there's people who've been waiting for their teas for a long time, um, and and I'm sorry. That's, I'm sorry you guys have been waiting so much. So from now on, guys, I'm just gonna send it directly from China. I'm just gonna from China to your door. Uh, I'm not gonna do this package stuff. I think the package, the big bulk packaging, is hap is better when um, when you have a lot of people. You know, if you know if you're like Yunnan sourcing. And you have like a hundred packages, then yeah, it's easier to send it to a warehouse and have the person whose job it is to break it up, break it up. Um, but for me, I don't put out too much. Say about once a week or so, not even a couple times a month. Um, so I'm just gonna from now on, just to make everything easier, right from China, right to your door. Take one last photo before I drink this. I'm so excited to drink this. Check out, check out this angle. This is coming up on the website. You get the behind the scenes right here going on. Let me, I'm on my, this is filming on my computer. That's why it's a little weird to behind the scenes. Oh, I don't want, I don't want the computer in the, in the shot though. This cup is huge. Um, I love cups. I love, I just love like. Wow, this is a big fucking cup. I did not realize how big this, to put it in perspective, like, that's a full Guy Wan pour in there. And it's not even halfway. It is a nice cup, though. I'm, I'm not going to lie. What I really like about this, this particular tea maker, um, is that 
he finds this line. He like, because you know, usually when people talk about like light uh, yenshas, you have like the heavy roast and you have the light roast. No, sorry, the heavy roast is a lot of texture, really dark and coffee and a heavy roast and cho dark chocolate and like smoky barbecue, you know, like dark, dark, dark. And then the light roast is like smooth and sweet and, you know, oranges, brown sugar, molasses, you know, that kind of lighterness, orangey. Um, but this one is in, this guy, what I, what I really like about his teas is that, watch, I'm, I'm from, I'm just going to go directly from the guy one to the cup. Um, what I really like about his teas is that he finds this kind of in between um, this in between part almost so guys I mean really to, to understand how big this cup is that's not even halfway that's a full guy one went into there <laughs> but so yeah so it has what I like about his is it has the characteristics of a dark roast you know you Definitely some, he does have like this fresh coffee bean aroma, cinnamon, um, a nice controlled texture. So it, it is texturous, you know, there is that roughness, but it's not crazy. It's not like a heavy roughness, more it's, more it's a fine roughness. Um, but the body is actually on the lighter side. You know, you, you have these notes, these feelings that you would expect with a heavy body, but the body stays pretty easy. Not even light, because it's not, you know, it's not light, but it's easy. It's a very easy body, very drinkable. Um, it's very drinkable. And you get these, you know, you, so you can taste these heavy notes without being overwhelmed. And that's what I really like about this tea. Um, and you know this, so even if this is like, and this is kind of what I go for, and this is what I, and when I buy teas, giving it to people and they've drank it, and even if it's not their favorite rogue way, you know, I can't promise when you taste any of the teas I sell, that's going to be your favorite. You know, I can't promise that you're going to be like, oh my God, this is the greatest thing ever, greatest tea. No, because that's, that's not how things work. Um, but you're going to drink it and you're going to be like, yes, this is good. This is good. You know, I like you can, you know, you can say, you know, personally, personally, I like Yunnan sourcings, yada, 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 yada more, or I like uh, Camellia sinensis's tea drunks, yada, 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 yada more, but this is good. First came to China in the spring, you know, I was really looking for this rogue wave flavor, you know, the rogue wave flavor. Um, this tea is deep, too. D depth is another thing we should talk about someday. There's something a little, I don't want to say fruity, meaty, something about 